Hello everyone, in today's quick video I will show you how to make toast message in Swift UI. So if you are familiar with uh, toast message inside Android Studio, then you know that something when you when you make some action there is there is small view that pops up somewhere on the screen and with some info text or error text or something it, it can be a, a result to an error from API request. As you can see here, this is simple view with, with text message and it is positioned at top of the screen. This is the whole, this is the class that holds everything you need to have uh, in your project. Basically what you can do is use this class, just copy paste it to your project and inside some view, you need to add toast view with toast binding that's uh, that's right here state private var toast which is now nil and somewhere in the code when you when you set it up so you initialize this variable with some message it will be shown on the screen that's all you need to do in order to incorporate this inside one of your projects uh, now let's get through this class very quickly. So this is a simple structure, toast, it conforms to equatable. Uh, the required parameter is message, so you need, to, you need to show some message. Duration is in my case three and a half seconds. You can modify this any, any way you want. I want to take it a full of it. So that's struct for our toast. This, this is our toast view, so, so that's the view that uh, basically lay out how toast looks like. Uh, here again we have a message and with simple body, horizontal stack, alignment in center, which contains text message. You can set font any way you want, foreground color, in my case that's a custom dark blue color, so that's the text color for this message. This is one spacer. On whole edge stack, we add some padding, frame, mean width, max width, background color, corner radius of eight, so that uh, that's rounded rectangle, some padding on left and right of 16, and this background color is system gray, so I set up system gray because this is the sound color that adapts to the different environment. For example, if your app is if your device is on dark mode, this will be a little darker version of gray. If you are on on default mode, it will be lighter and something like that. Below that, we have a structure, toast modifier. So this is a Swift UI modifier that can be that you can apply to any view. Again, we have we have here our toast instance of toast. Uh, this helps us to dismiss the toast message after some time in our body. So what we do here is we use original content, content some view, and on that we apply frame and over, uh, overlay with this stack our toast view. So we show our toast view on top of the some original content. So on top of the um so of some screen. With some animation you can change this, delete this, it's not really important. And offset is 32. So when you press this, this offset is 32 from top of the screen. If you say, if you set up 100, then then toast will be somewhere here. If you say 0, then it will be here. So that's up, up to you where, where you want it. Okay, this is our main toast view. It returns some view. Here we just check if the toast is not nil and show it in a V stack. Spacer is here to move it to the top of the screen. Uh, again, show toast. So on change, that's important. When toast uh, instance, so when this variable that is state changes, then we want to show a toast. Uh, here again we check for the 
no ability so if it's not nil we we continue with our code uh, okay this is the task which dismisses toast so when we use time which is now plus toast, toast duration which is three and a half seconds and after that we execute a task this task uh, dismisses our toast so this task with animation sets toast state variable again to nil so the next time you change this variable inside some, some of your view then it will show it again and we cancel work item and set it also to nil and the last thing in this case is extension view method so this is a simple extension that helps us to uh, to just use it on some view inside our project here we have binding variable of toast it returns some view and here we use our modifier which we uh, created up there we use our modifier with toast binding variable so this uh, this method is here uh, what i showed you so i use this overall on our whole I believe on our whole vstack on vstack on this screen i added this extension method up there created state variable for toast which is nil when when we initialize it we we just show our toast message and that's basically it you can use this throughout the whole project anywhere you need it and it is really simple uh, again i will i will uh, i will add I will uh, give you this code. You can just copy paste this, put it in one file inside the util package and use it anywhere you want. If this video is, was helpful to you, please subscribe to my channel. You can find a bunch more videos about SwiftUI topic, uh, deprecation of some methods and a lot of useful stuff. Uh, see you in the next video. Bye bye.